Hello beautiful people, welcome back to the channel. Well, I know it has been a while, but today I am back with an extremely good news. I just finished the food delivery, I mean the food ordering project, and thus I just finished the food ordering course. Well guys, uh, since a lot of you guys were requesting for me to finish the course, I decided to kind of stop everything and just focus on that every single day. And I can tell you the, pro the project looks amazing. We have features like adding products to cart, making orders, getting all products for a particular from a particular restaurant, products from a category, doing searches and filters and getting featured products on the home screen of the app getting popular restaurants on the home screen on the app and all of that so here i'll show you guys a bit what i have done with the project or what we have up until now and um obviously there are always more features that we can add to this but we can do that with uh time so i hope you guys are excited and uh the lesson two for this video i'm showing you guys is going to drop tomorrow the lesson two for the food ordering course is dropping tomorrow you have the project link in the description so you can go on google play store download it test on your mobile app on your mobile phone uh, to check if that's something you would like to build and uh you have the source code for the github in the link uh, below as well so do that. If you enjoy, drop a like, comment, and show me some love. See you guys. So guys, uh, here are some of the features that we have on our final uh, pro project. Obviously, we have user authentication. This was one of the first one. The user can either uh, log in or register with a new account. On our example, we are going to register, and um, when the registration process is complete, this is our home screen. We have our categories, featured products, and restaurants. And this is the restaurant view. Actually, when you click on the restaurant, you get all of the products for that restaurant. When you click on the ob uh, on the product, you can go to the product details, add product to cart. You can search the products. For example if the product is not found you have and you don't have to write the complete name just some letters can get you the product and you can open up the restaurant from there you can see your orders at the beginning are just empty because we didn't order nothing yet so we can go to our uh, food details add them to cart and you have the information saying that it's added to cart and now we can add them we can click on checkout so that our orders will be filled we can do our search by restaurants we filtered now we want to search restaurants and not um, actually searching the product or, or or the food and now in here we will try to check out when the cart is empty and it will tell us that the cart is empty thus you cannot check out if we go and uh, click on our orders since we did order something now have our orders updated so this is basically what we have for now 